official app. Download it today in the App Store. Welcome to Costa Rica. This is a five-minute power arms class that will help develop strength, mobility, and endurance in your arms and upper body. This class is meant to be customized for your level. So if you need to stop at any point, pause the video and start again when you're ready. Or if you make it all the way through, challenge yourself and see if you can do it twice. The goal though, is to be able to do three reps of this video in a row with short breaks in between and not to forget to work hard and have fun. Welcome friends, let's start at the center of our mat and warm up our shoulders. Roll them backwards and forwards, one at a time, whatever your body is asking for. Listen to what it has to say and try to find the solution that it's looking for. Shake out those arms a little bit and let's get ready. Take a big stretch up above your heads, clasp your fingers behind your back and take a deep breath. Now let's begin. Let's start in plank position at the front of our mat. We're gonna go into shoulder taps, opposite hand touching opposite shoulder. All right, here we go. One and two. One and two. Keeping your body flat and two. One and two. Connecting breath in and out. Couple more in and out. Short breaths, bursts of air. One and two. One and two. Last one, one and two great job let's go back into downward dog bouncing your weight into your feet we're going to shoot forward into plank take a deep breath and exhale that's one inhale come back exhale into plank that's two inhale come back to downward dog exhale that's three inhale come back and exhale into plank inhale downward dog exhale plank and back to downward dog, we're gonna add a push-up. Exhale into plank, drop it down, lift it up, back into downward dog, that's one. Plank, push-up, up into plank again, and inhale downward dog, exhale plank, inhale down, exhale up, inhale downward dog. Connecting with your breath into plank, down, up, and downward dog. One more into plank, push-up down, back up, and downward dog. One more variation, dropping our knees, not letting them touch the mat, and pushing forward into plank, down to push up, up, and downward dog. Drop the knees, don't touch, sliding your chest across the mat, pushing yourself into push up, dropping, lifting, and downward dog. That's two. Let's go third one, slide the chest across the mat, coming up into plank, dropping into push up, lifting up, and going back into downward dog. Drop the knees, shoot across the mat, dropping down, chest to the mat, lifting up, and downward dog. Last one, drop the knees, shooting across with all the grace you have left, dropping into push-up, lifting yourself back up, and coming to downward facing dog. All right, let's just take a quick breather here. Coming onto our knees, shake out those shoulders again, rolling the shoulders. And if you want to bring the arm across, stretch the triceps and the scapula, you can do exactly as I'm doing here. Or just continue rolling the shoulders. Whatever feels good, just for this quick little intermission before we come back to downward facing dog where we left off. But this time, raise up onto the very tips of your toes and we're gonna drop our head down to the mat and push back up. And drop again and up. Exhale down, inhale up, that's three. Down and up. Down and up, staying on the tips of your toes as you push down and up. Couple more as you drop down, pushing back up. Drop down, pushing back up, last one. Big breath in, great job. Let's come into plank once again at the front of our mat, holding as still and straight as we can and rotate in circles to the right. There we go, little baby circles, really feeling those arms activate. And now to the left, there we go, breathing in and exhaling consciously as we feel our shoulders start to protest a little bit. 
All right, beautiful. Let's come back to downward facing dog. Drop onto our elbows. We're gonna take this into dolphin. Clasp your fingers together and we're gonna shoot our body towards our hands in the top of the mat. Exhale out and inhale, push back. That's one. Exhale, dropping and back. That's two. Exhale, inhale, back up, dropping down and lifting up. Coming to the earth and pushing to the sky. Exhale, inhale, exhale. Big breath in. Beautiful. Do your best to keep up, but if you have to stop and take a break, totally cool. One more, here we go, and pushing up. Holding just for a second here, we're gonna come back to downward facing dog and take the impossible push up. This is dropping our elbows slowly down to the mat as we dive our chest towards, plant our hands, and lift into upward facing dog. Then swing back, drop elbows, bring chest, and scoop up. That's two. Drop the elbows, sliding our body, don't touch the mat, and upward facing dog three. Drop elbows, scooping through, looking up to the sky, four, and exhaling as we drop, inhaling as we come up, that's five. We're halfway there, drop the elbows, scoop, upward facing dog, and downward. All right, drop the elbows, slide across the mat, push the earth away, and downward facing dog. Couple more here. There you go, upward facing dog. Downward, two more. Drop the elbows, digging deep, pushing up to the sky. And last one, elbows down and pushing up. Holding an upward dog here just for a stretch and a moment. Excellent job, they call it the impossible push up for a reason. Let's find our way back into child's pose just to give our shoulders an activated counter stretch here. Forehead to the mat chest down to the earth reaching forward with your fingers and coming back up that's a wrap great job if you made it all the way through let's see if you can do it a second or a third time this is meant to be a three rep series so if you work your way mindfully up to three reps and do it three days in a row with one day off for three weeks straight you'll end up with superhuman arm strength i swear <laughs> Thanks for being here with me, guys. Hope to see you again soon. Namaste.